Good morning, Vlogmas. I'm off to my first SLT class. I'm so excited. I've wanted to try this Pilates class for a while now. And Maggie and Emma and Nat have gone, and I'm going with them. And let's get it. Happy Vlogmas, Natal. Happy Vlogmas. Day You're five. glowing right now in this lighting. It's just, it's just your eyes look well. so pretty. I was talking with someone about your eyes the other day. Well, also, how we I tried putting lip plumber on, and I guess I missed. I don't know if it's still red, no. but I had red all over my face because it was plumping my outer. Your, oh, chain. yeah, I saw the picture of that. I was like, oh. And it hurts. I was like, that's really I was like, what is going on? Guys, my first Pilates. How are you well, feeling? Okay, I did. A Pilates reformer, but it looked a lot different, like once in Albany, like years no, ago. No, those I don't are like their, these it. are their own type of reformer. Yeah, this is different. It was really hard. My whole body is like still shaking. Mm -hmm. I like fell off the reformer in the beginning because my hamstring fell apart. Mm -hmm. I decided to just not the bite anymore. The bite out of it like snapped it. <laughs> yeah, my hamstrings were really weak, so the beginning was tough, but it was so good. Yeah. yeah. I like this studio. It's all just open and fun. I love. Honestly, true. Guys, that was so hard. Natalie has time. Her shins are mini. Look at those. They're about to snap. <laughs> okay. I took mine off and I just them away because I realized that every time I try to wear sunglasses, I don't wear sunglasses. Yeah, like I'll put them on my head and they're like, what am I doing? I never wear I them like either. Them. I have so many and I don't wear them. Yeah, You're so good at wearing them, Maggie. I, I used to be like, remember I would have all the mirrored rebands? Oh my yeah, God, wait, that's color. I had red. Um, I wanted to tell them how Maggie was like, I thought she was going to say she has deja vu because she always has deja vu. But she was like, no, not that. And I was like, that sounds like food. Like, I've been eating so much deja vu. But we were having a cute moment because it is really special that we all live so close to each other. And we get to hang out and do what we do. Like it's 11.30 on a, two, on a, on a Thursday. Thursday. And we just went to Pilates. We went to Pilates and we're getting like matcha. We're so I'm going to go record my podcast today. Nat and I are going to film a video. Like we are getting after it. Don't worry. But this is a fun moment. <gasps> we both just got so scared. I don't think so. Wait, this happened to me the other day. And I had to walk all the way around. <laughs> I want to jump. We can do it. Ready? That scares me with your bag. Okay, I'm going to do a running start. Ooh! <laughs> I made it! <laughs> okay, yay. Matcha time, except I don't think I can get it because yesterday when I got it, I was like shaking. I was like, Quaking. how I used to feel when I would drink like a Venny coffee. Venny? A Venny. <laughs> you can put the tea in there. A Venny. <laughs> a Venny coffee. I'm saying a Venny. The tea. Replay, Venny. <laughs> I don't know what that sounds like. I know. Oh, oh, nice so cute. Oh, <laughs> We're all know. filming him. <laughs> how many months is It's been a very chill day, everybody. I don't think I've vlogged since um, SLT and like after when we went to Thinking Cup. I'm so <laughs> cozy right now. Natalie is here. Natty B in the house. I'm trying to find a quote. We're about <laughs> me before every podcast. We're about to record for my podcast. I'm so excited because there's literally a million things we could do. Like she'll definitely be on it again because you could just be like your funny self, but I think we're gonna get in our feels because I have like yeah. questions for her. And I want her advice and a lot of people were like, can you just make a podcast about advice? And I'm like who better to do it with than Natalie because I always get good advice from her So, sweet. so it's I gonna be I so good took my own advice. <laughs> I literally like do the opposite of what I tell people <laughs> That's so do. true though. Like it's so easy I feel like to give someone else good advice because you know deep down, but then when it's you you're like Oh no, like it's I'll go crawling back to this boyfriend that sucks yeah. or like whatever um, Oh, and we're really cozy in yes, these blankets. Are. Not that our boyfriends suck. I just meant like as an example. Yeah. I was like, this is gonna be taken the wrong way. But you know, like I feel like whenever you're in a bad relationship, it's so easy to be like, tell your friends like, you don't need that. People say nothing is impossible, but I do nothing every day. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny because we always start off my podcast with, 
what we're happy about right now and like a happy quote half the time i make up the happy quote if there's just like a happy saying that you like live by or like your favorite quote or something we can do that and we might also film you guys which would be so funny a video of like roasting old photos of us or like yeah I'm so nervous. Oh, I'm There's so excited to do that. My eyebrows and my eyebrows. <laughs> eyebrow glow up. <laughs> and my hair was like dark brown and yeah. Anyway. Um, uh, we're gonna get recording. This is hey. our little setup. I oh don't look at that. Actually it has my apartment number on it, but it's a box I got today. And my microphone just looks like it's floating in the air. And we're gonna sit on either side and record. Our podcast went so good, you guys. It was so fun to record with her. I always knew that I wanted to, and yeah, I just was really excited about the episode. So if you guys haven't listened to my podcast, you should definitely go listen. Happy hour on uh Apple Podcasts and Spotify. So would recommend but now maggie and emma are about to come pick me up because if you guys know jessica howell she does youtube instagram yeah we met her in curacao and she's coming to visit which is so fun because maggie's birthday party is this weekend so she's like coming for that and i don't think she's ever been to boston so it's gonna be really fun to show her around i think she's never been to soul cycle either so we'll bring her to her first soul cycle class tomorrow morning and after we pick her up we're gonna go get thai food for dinner so i'm so excited to see her and we can all hang out <laughs> this is so cute Hi. how do you feel about the snow I'm tell so us happy. <laughs> we're going to one of our favorite thai places everybody Guys, Maggie is showing us her new slippers. She's so excited about them. They're luxury. They're like the ones that you get at the hotel, and she's always <laughs> obsessed with the hotel ones. And yeah. she'd wear them to the beach. In Hawaii. So now it's like walk around hotel in her apartment. <laughs> but these ones, my tried and trues. <laughs> I'm not linking them on Amazon because they're literally going to be sold out. Really? Sorry, guys. <laughs> no. And then you won't be able to get them again. I know, but like, there was this Like all your coconut... I was just I gonna say that your coconut like water and I shared it online and guess what now sold it's out. It's been sold out for a year and she can't Ever get it. I, it and I can't get it anymore. <laughs> yeah. So and sorry so guys. Good luck. Like, it, and it used to be twenty dollars for like individual little coconut waters and now they sell it for a hundred dollars. Are you kidding one me? One that I used to pay twenty bucks for. Oh my god. It's so sad. I've DM'd them. Wait, times. it's called Wayola. 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 So, I remember but they're so cute just Yay. Hotel also maggie got a bunch of new stuff from cb2 sneak peek it's really cute coming yeah. soon i love it this oh and i so learned so guys don't oh, if you ever good. come here <laughs> don't, yeah, this is for my don't grab her black erlenmeyer flask because it's not a flask <laughs> it's literally an oil diffuser <laughs> and i crafted my hand turn black did it really? Yes. Yeah. I thought it was a flask from oh science class. I was like, why do you have a flask over there? That's fun. It's not a flask. Okay. No, That's the bio major in me coming out. It's a, it's a, it's an oil diffuser. No, it's, it's a, a beaker. Beaker. Yeah. Every time for. she kept saying flask, I'm like, what? No, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. No, You're going to take out your boot to a bar? <laughs> Wait, is the beaker the one that's a triangle and yeah, then the flask? Beaker. No, that's a beaker. A flask is a what's the flask? Then the straight. No, that's a cylinder. They have a no. It's a. It's called a. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. We're, We're god. struggling. Oh Someone god. help us. It's a graduated cylinder. No, a graduated cylinder. A bigger one that has like a measuring cup. Oh, the, the oh yeah, it is. The thin, the thick one. The thick, thick. Jess and a puffa. Please. Why? Maggie and her down comforter. What is this? No, it's it's a big puffa. Big puffa, little puffa. Hey, and that's a mega puffa. <laughs> this, that one? No, Jess, you need to wear that one. That one's a big blanket. <laughs> you literally need to wear that one, yeah. You're going to feel like you rolled out of bed with your down comforter on, and it's so amazing. You're going to be obsessed. Yeah, they're from Ritzia. This doesn't. Isn't that one amazing? Oh my God. That one's cute though. <laughs> so I am back from dinner now. It was so good, you guys. First of all, Thai food is just like really yummy and always a treat in itself. But seeing Jess, like, it's just so fun. I'm so happy she's visiting, and especially like I always say, how bringing people to Soul Cycle for the first time is so special because it's like such a community and a space and like a workout obviously that I love so much and to like bring someone new for the first time is just like 
so awesome so i'm really happy because we get to do that tomorrow morning but also just in general her being in boston because we love it here so much and it's literally our home and we just get to like show her around and stuff it's like so amazing sorry i keep touching my hair i'm gonna not do that it's just you know those days when it's not crap cooperating so <clears throat> it's been such a good night but i wanted to unwind and just bring you guys with me while I get unready for the night and just talk about stress really quickly because I know especially during the holidays it can be such a fun exciting time but also a very stressful time like being with so many members of your extended family and all these crazy travel plans and stuff so yeah I just wanted to talk about self-care stress stuff like that quickly so obviously self-care is something that's so important to me and I know I've talked about that before and I just think it's something that's so important and more than just like bubble baths face masks, manicures, like those are all amazing. But also what really plays into it as well is just being really proactive in your healthcare. So CVS is working with me on this video. Thank you so much CVS for sponsoring this video. You guys know I'm obsessed with them. You can check out your local CVS obviously or click the link in the description below and just go to cvs.com to you know see any of the products I'm gonna be telling you about or all their other amazing products I know you guys already use and that's I use too. And I know that CVS is actually rolling out hundreds of new proactive wellness products all over the country that make taking care of yourself and treating yourself just an easy part of your daily routine so so excited to show you guys the products that I have tonight for just stress management and in general products that I've been loving okay ready the first thing you guys I cannot recommend these more than anything else in my whole life if me and Emma could make a whole video about how amazing these are we would we live by these like tested and true what is that phrase like Time and time again, these are just here for us. I have been having such a hard time sleeping recently in the last couple of weeks. I've been staying up so uncharacteristically late. I don't know why that is just like not something that normally happens to me. I normally don't have that hard of a time going to sleep. It like depends, which I'll tell you about it. Like I've taken melatonin in the past, but something about these hit different. I mean, I'm always say that. The Ollie Sleep, they're Ollie Sleep for Healthy Sleep Psycho Melatonin. L-theanine and botanicals. They're like a sleep vitamin. They hit different. There's something is different about these. They're so amazing. They make me sleep so well, but I'm not like groggy when I wake up. So yeah, I don't know why. I honestly think I've just been really like anxious and stressed about like so much that's going on. And like I said, the holidays is such a crazy time with like plans and family and all these new people and everything. So I don't know what has been up with me, but I've been going to bed so late. So you know what? Let's take them right now. Because once you take them, you take them 30 minutes before you go to sleep. So once I take two, guys, I already need to get like a new jar. I've been taking these like every night for the last couple nights now. Um, I took them. I remember when I was traveling recently. I mean, before I went to Hawaii, like I've been taking these for a while. Um, I was like, I know I want to go to bed at 8. Like I want to get a lot of sleep before my flight. And we have to leave it like... 3 a.m. or 4 a.m. for the airport and these are the only thing that can make me go to bed like really early because they like help me fall asleep because they make you so sleepy and just relaxed and especially when I'm feeling like anxious during the day if I've had too much coffee or too much matcha or something and I'm like buzzing I like really need these to like calm me down so these are so amazing and now I will have to go to sleep in the next 30 minutes because these will make me so sleepy and they just give me like the best sleep I could not literally say enough good things about those in specific they just make me sleep so well like I'm so rested and I don't wake up and I'm not stressed and I swear like I just can't say enough good things about these because a lot of times when I sleep too I feel like I'm like this I sleep really tense do any of you guys feel that way and I wake up in the morning and I feel like oh like I feel like I need to stretch and I feel like I slept so like stressed and anxious just like subconsciously worrying about things and I swear when I take these I just like <sighs> relax and I'm all cozy and yeah obviously couldn't recommend those enough moving on because i could i could make a whole podcast about those to be honest okay this is a aromatherapy room mist and these are 100 percent essential oils of lavender armoise and clary sage i don't know how to say that word but you know what this smells exactly like guys and this makes me so like zen and calm when you were growing up did you ever have those like lavender smelling pets that you would like put in the microwave i know that sounds weird like stuffed animals and they would be like warm and they would smell like lavender they'd be really like, soothing and you could sleep when you were a little kid or like did your parents ever have that or i have like just like lavender stuff i know is like good for sleep so anyway it just reminds me of like my childhood and i spray this in my room i'll show you guys after this and it makes it like so zen and helps me sleep a lot and then I have this Himalayan Pink Salt Body Soak Refreshing and Balancing Blood Orange. That's like the set. I am so excited to try this out. I couldn't 
even tell you guys how excited I am because when I was in lightweight rowing at BU, people were so into the um, like soak, like the what's it called? The like the body, the body soaks. People were so into the body soaks in the bathtub because it really is supposed to help with like sore muscles and just like feeling your best. And I know also soul cycle instructors always post about that, like taking a bath in like the salt and it's supposed to really help with like sore muscles so that's such a good way to self-care and i was gonna say last but not least actually two more things this is for when you really just want to treat yourself these are the bark fin snacking chocolate dark chocolate almond with sea salt these are my favorite and the pretzel ones you guys so good and these i would just so recommend especially if you want something sweet but you don't want to like go eat a whole cake like that's probably excessive but these are so good because they are vegan and they're obviously not like eating fruit but it's like really good for what it is and yeah it's just like dark chocolate really whole like almond sea salt it doesn't have like oh my gosh the ingredients you guys are so minimal and a lot of the candy you'll normally eat has like lists and lists of stuff this is dark chocolate mm, cocoa butter soy something dry roasted almond sea salt so it's like so minimal ingredients and i love um just having products that you can read all the ingredients and understand what it is like that's just something that's really good in general and then last but not least i just took some footage of it on my bed because it's really heavy and i didn't want to like hold it up right now it's my weighted blanket amazing i'm obsessed with all these products if you can tell and i know you guys saw me post about it like maybe a couple weeks ago on my instagram story and i got so many questions about it and so i thought i would just talk about it here it's a 15 pound weighted blanket it's from cbs it's just dark gray and it's amazing i love using this in the specific moment which i'll talk about this after this but it's like when i'm winding down at night i'm finishing up work on my computer and i feel like i'm so go 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 all day and i need to like breathe and i have been feeling like so more anxious than I ever have in my life and I know it's just because I have like a lot going on Max isn't here, Lucy's in here, my dad, the whole thing and it really helps me a lot and I was getting so many questions on if it helps with anxiety and I feel like it really does a lot and these babies when I can't sleep at night help a lot so um, yeah I recommend so much obviously like I said CVS will be linked down below you can find all of these like in your local CVS and now I'm going to take off my makeup, brush my teeth. I mean, I think I just put on a little bit of bronzer. When I'm feeling lazy, you guys, I put on like a swipe of bronzer and I curl my eyelashes. That's literally it because I'm just feeling so lazy. So we are going to, yeah, brush my teeth, wash my face, put up my little hair, and go lay under my weighted blanket, post my vlogmas because it's so late and normally I want to get it up earlier in the night but I've just been so busy. I need like to add the finishing touches like the thumbnail and everything, upload that and oh it's Thursday night too so my podcast is going up for Friday. Like I said we're just finishing up the night of work and the weighted blanket really helps me unwind. I spray my spray and all is well. <laughs> whole life is literally CVS. If you knew, especially like where I live, there's a CVS one second away from me. Guess where I get my toothbrush? My toothbrush. My okay. My toothpaste. CVS. Guess where I get my floss picks? Literally says CVS right on it. That is so funny. I'm just a CVS girl. Tried and true. That's what I was trying to say earlier. <laughs> Okay, ready? Now that I'm all ready for bed, this is my specific moment when I like using my weighted blanket. So first of all, I spray my spray, just like that, <laughs> and it gets me in a zen mood. Then, oh, I need my blue light glasses. They help me so much. I've been wearing my new pink ones because I think they're fun. And then I crawl under my weighted blanket like this. And I finish up my work for the night. And it makes me feel just so good. Like, honestly, it's better if you're not doing work. You can just, like, relax for a moment. Like, it just feels so good on you. If you can hear it, it sounds like little bean bags. Like, they're just, like, weighted little compartments. And now, it's work time, people. By the way, you guys, those Ollie Sleep Vitamins are really 
kicking in. I can feel them. I just start to feel like so. Oh, hello. I just start to feel so zen and like calm and like sleepy. <laughs> so with that, good night and sleep well, everybody. Hey, you guys. I'm realizing. I just had to turn the light back on <clears throat> for this and everything, but oh, these ollies are kicking. I really got to go to bed. I realized I never asked you guys my question of the day earlier, so we're asking right now. I've been thinking about it all day too, and I like thought that I recorded it, I think, because I was thinking about it all day, but then I actually didn't, and um, my question is actually not a question that I'm answering. I'm just going to ask you guys because I want to know the answer. What I want to know is how you found my channel. Oh my gosh, my arm is tired from holding it up. <laughs> um, so will you please comment down below how you found my channel because I'm just so interested if you found me through like one of my friends because obviously I have like so many friends around YouTube or if you found me from like a recommended video or you like typed in a video and mine came up and you've been subscribed or are you just like an OG and you found my videos five years ago and you're still watching or like yeah, I'm just like really curious how you found my channel and I'm wondering if you like most of you came from one video or like one you know recommended video or one period of time in my life and you found me for all see I'm just really interested so comment that below and I'm realizing this is like a lot shorter of a vlog because I like chilled for a while after Pilates today because it was so hard and then I recorded the podcast from that but obviously I wasn't like filming that and then Jessica came to town it's so funny because when we were going to pick her up both time we were like yes jessica i don't know why where that came from but it was so good to see her and it's gonna be so fun to like hang out with her this weekend like i was saying soul in the morning so that's gonna be so good and i did want to decorate our christmas tree in this vlog actually but that just like never happened taylor came back like late from work and was so tired and I'm like we can just do it like tomorrow or the next day so coming soon because we need to still go get um yeah like ornaments on our christmas tree but hopefully you enjoyed this chill little vlog and i'll see you guys in my next video